Hello students! In this video, you will learn how to create a greeting card using Canva. First, go to canva.com, sign up if it's the first time you use Canva, or log in with Google. With a free account, you can use Canva without having to pay. To create a card, click the Create a Design tab on the upper right corner and select the card design type or from Templates, choose Card. The Templates tab in the side panel shows a collection of card designs. Choose a layout you like or type in your search. Click on a free template you like. The template is just a guide to get you started. To customize your card, you can remove elements with a delete button and put other elements in their place. You can also delete elements by pressing the delete key on your keyboard. You can zoom in, click the Uploads tab in the side panel to upload your own photos. Once the photo uploads, click and put it in place. Resize by dragging. Right click for more options. Delete the other picture. Replace background. If you make a mistake, click Undo. Add effects, filters, adjust, crop or flip. Change its position. Create effects by making different elements more or less transparent. Select an element. Tap the transparency icon on the top bar and move the slider to your desired level of transparency. Click the Photo tab to choose an image, but choose a free image, not a premium image. Type in a keyword, click on the image to select it. Click the Elements tab in the side panel to find illustrations, drawings, shapes, frames, stickers, grids, etc. A grid is a box where you can drop in photos. Choose a free element. Click and drag to resize and move it. You can change the color of the elements. You can use letter frames. Type in letter frames, click and drag to resize,
create effects by dragging a photo over a letter. Write a message. Add a page. Click the text tab to add text. There are text boxes you can put in and edit. Or you can just press T on the keyboard and a text box will appear. Choose the font Choose the size Choose the color and more options like bold, italics, underline, capital letters, alignment, etc. Choose a font that can be easily read. Include a few lines to get your message across. Avoid cliches, keep it brief and to the point. Then add images, illustrations, photos or other graphics. You can add music or videos. You can change the background. Click the More option to access more content, like free pictures from Pexels and Pixabay, Emoji, Bitmoji, YouTube videos, etc. Add a GIF to your design by choosing the GIFI app. Search for GIFs using keywords to find GIFs on a particular theme. Click and then drag to put it in its place. You can change the color of an element. As you're working, all changes are automatically saved. When you're done editing, you can print your greeting card or share it online. Click the Share button and select Share a link to edit. If you want to share your design with another student and work together to make it better. If you work by yourself, select Share a link to view. Copy the link and paste it into a message in social media or your teacher's Padlet wall. Click the More Options button, share the link, copy and paste the link onto the Padlet, for example. Select Download. 
and choose the format in which you want to download it. JPEG is for downloading elements at a small file size. PDF print is the best format for printing. MP4 is for downloading videos. GIF is for when you want your graphic to animate continuously. You can download it for free. That's how you can create, share and download a greeting card using Canva. Be creative and have fun!